go to, what music you want to make the soundtrack to your life. And to anyone who... Beyonce and Taylor Swift, two of music's top stars, were among the big winners at Monday's 2024 iHeartRadio Music Awards stemming from the Dolby Theater in Los Angeles. Swift sent in a clip to Monday's 2024 iHeartRadio Music Awards to accept the honors for Artist of the Year, while Beyoncé was at the Dolby Theater in Los Angeles to accept the honors for 2024 iHeartRadio Innovator on Monday. Swift, 34, was nominated against Miley Cyrus, Drake, Jelly Roll, Luke Combs, Morgan Wallen, Olivia Rodrigo, Shakira, SZA, and Usher for the honors. Artist of the Year. Hey, I wanted to say thank you so much to anyone who voted for this award. I want to say thank you so much to anyone who voted for this award, the singer-songwriter said in her speech, as she was seated in a room. I heart. You have just been so incredibly supportive over the course of my entire career. The Grammy winner was coming off a busy weekend as she and boyfriend Travis Kelsey spent Easter Sunday in Pennsylvania before returning to Southern California Monday afternoon, arriving in Burbank at 1.30 p.m. Pacific time. Swift said that the past year has been pretty spectacular, and she's so grateful for that. The singer added, To the fans, it's completely up to you to choose how you spend your time, what concerts you want go to, what music you want to make the soundtrack to your life. To anyone who has included me in those choices, I'm so, so, so thankful for that. Swift said that she has many exciting things ahead, as she continued on with the Era's tour and has a new studio album called The Tortured Poets Department due out April 19th. I'm so proud of it, Swift said. Cannot wait to share it with you. Thank you for voting for me for Artist of the Year. I can't wait to keep having fun with you guys. We have a lot of exciting things coming up. Thank you so much. Beyonce was presented with the honors by musical icon Stevie Wonder, 73, as she noted, I'm honored to receive this recognition from you, Stevie Wonder. Whenever anyone asks me if there's anything I can listen to for the rest of my life, it's always you. Thank you. God bless you. Beyonce opened up on the methods of being an innovator in her speech. Call me an innovator and I'm grateful. She said, innovation starts with a dream. Then you have to execute that dream. That road can be very bumpy. Being even innovator is seeing what everyone believes is impossible. It means being criticized often, which often will test your mental strength. She added that being an innovator is leaning on faith and trusting God will catch you and guide you. And that she hopes people are more open to the joy and liberation that comes from enjoying art with no preconceived notions. The single ladies put a ring on it. Artists dedicated the iHeart honors to all the innovators who have dedicated their lives and their art to creating shifts.